Fritz Ford is a media partner with InstantRiverside.com. Fritz Ford on Auto Drive in the Riverside Auto Center and online at FritzFord.com. Instant, intelligent information. At first look, this large blue pipe may not appear high tech, but it is the first in the nation to be used to harness the power of canal water and make it into electricity. In this case, it's the gauge canal. And this is essentially capturing energy that would have been wasted otherwise. The water will pretty much always flow through here. Um, it's flowing at a, a greater velocity than it needs to to do what the pipeline is for. So here's a chance to essentially get free electricity. This hydroelectric device is inside the pipe. When the pipe is full of water, it will spin the turbine and then provide force for a generator. This, that turbine will spin and turn that shaft in the middle. What we don't see here yet. What we don't have on site yet is a generator that sits on top here, the part that actually makes the electricity. And so the, uh, once, once that's installed, that's the part that gets wired up and actually feeds into our, into our power system. The power will go to, um, to a pump station that we have that pumps essentially the water goes through and it, we need some energy to run that pump station. So right now it'll just go through that pump station. Eventually it could be tied into homes, it could be tied into our grid. This type of hydroelectric power is a new invention. The cost to Riverside is nothing, and the manufacturer has partnered with Riverside for this first-of-a-kind test. Well, right now for Riverside, it's a zero-cost project because um, re really the, the company that owns the rights to this is, is doing this for free. This is the same as a couple of rooftop solar systems in terms of the amount of power that it will produce. Uh, completely green. There's, there's no emissions from this. Roughly 130 years ago, it was the Gage Canal that helped put Riverside on the map by supplying valuable water for the lucrative citrus industry. There's always water running through our pipes, so it's a renewable resource. As you said, it's untapped power, untapped energy. This is the lifeblood of Riverside, but now not only is it the lifeblood for the citrus industry, but now we're using it for, to generate electrical power. So it's, for that use, it's innovative and fantastic. It allows us to, to look at different avenues for utilizing these resources that we have so that we can keep our energy prices low, we can keep our water prices low. Now that water, just as valuable as ever, is serving a new purpose, one that holds the promise of saving Riversiders on their electric bills. I'm Craig Figner, and this is InstantRiverside.com. Local news for the Inland Empire is on InstantRiverside.com.